What is up everybody? In today's video we are going to be stopping by an old friend of mine's house uh, and we are going to be checking out his newly finished project car. All that in today's episode. My name is Ryan. This is Project Race Car. Let's get into it. So my friend just recently finished this. This is actually in Colorado. Um, I was able to actually stop by his house and check out the project car so it is really cool. I figured it would be appropriate for the channel because He's throwing a JDM motor in a old BMW, so this thing should be perfect. With that being said, I hope you guys had wonderful holidays and spent some good time with family. But without further ado, let's get into it. So, Brennan, you explain to us uh, what you got, what you got here. It's a GZX100, uh, okay. 1JZ R154 DVTI, um, with a drift motion turbo kit, which is junk, even this bad boy. So you got the, uh, the precision. Uh, 6266. Uh, it's a wiring specialties harness. Uh, with the CAN bus to make the dash work. Uh, Link G4X Storm, uh, Chase Bay's brake booster delete, Chase Bay's power steering with the cooler, Chase Bay's radiator. So uh, what made you decide to build the E46? What, what was the, kind of the story about the engine? Did you find the engine before or uh, I know that you had a Cressida build before this but so yeah, I pretty much built the engine in a parking lot for uh, Cressida, and then once the one uh, JZ prices went through the roof, I was like, man, this engine should not be in a shitbox anymore. That's fair. So uh, I went did some searching, and I found the M3 Roller for okay. 2400. And okay. Uh, what kind of power do you think that it's? Uh, it's on a base map right now, but but Dino says like 400. 400. Okay. So I know you kind of explained a little bit to me, but um, the fitment, was there any issues getting the uh, the 1J in the E46? Um, the only problems I had was right here, and okay. that's not the 1J's fault, that's the Syntake's fault. Cool. Um, the brake booster, I could have modified a stock one, but I said, fuck that. Cool. Got it. This nice. I know that uh, it's still a work in progress, but this thing is absolutely sick. I like it. Uh, what year is the chassis? It's uh, 2002. 2002, cool. Tools for the interior, or what, what are they? Are you just gonna keep it stock, kind of uh, refresh a little bit? Yeah, I'm gonna keep it stock until I have too much money to know what to do with. Okay. <laughs> I still gotta go. do the whole rear end and coilovers. And... How do the, uh, you're still on stock brakes, how do the, those, uh, those bad boys do? Um, they work, you know. Okay. I haven't even touched the brakes. Gotcha. I've done pads, don't even know how much life is left, but it gotcha. still stops. Nice. <laughs> you got uh, the, uh, the HREs. You yeah, buddy. They look clean. Overall, the chassis is in really good condition. Um, it, uh, not too many dings or scratches or nicks. I like it. Hit it with a startup. So the exhaust isn't hooked up, right? No. Okay. Oh, So planted. Uh, it's uh, we were just talking about his Cressida build versus this thing, and uh, he said the Cressida felt like uh, it was on ice skates, and this thing is uh, for sure planted.
once the tune is set, once the new turbo is on, uh, this thing is gonna be insane. Um, and new tires. That's uh, that's gonna be another another must. Some sticky boys. Yeah. Get all those. Uh, the Christmas tree. Yeah. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Just a little bit. What are the plans for the car uh, this year, 2023? 2023. I would like to have the rear end taken care of. Okay. Which is full suspension. Cool. And the reinforcements and shit. Cool. And then uh, carbon fiber roof because they need to pull the front and rear windshields off anyway. So. Because the cracking yeah and while I'm in there and then uh, uh, hopefully a big brake kit okay I need that yeah uh, stopping is important and then the next. precision turbo is next yeah the precision 6266 okay uh, tuning whiskey uh, I mean all that's gonna be happening like in two weeks yeah but. never ends well I'm excited to uh, to see this thing hopefully we can see this uh, when it actually gets like completely done obviously this is just a little bit of uh, just brand new stuff so um, thank you for letting us uh, see the car and uh, for a ride and yeah hell yeah hell yeah